Hey guys, Laguna here, and um, today we're going to talk about uh, ping and lag related issues that a lot of people may be having uh, while trying to connect to the Blaine Soul servers. While I'm streaming, I uh, I always hear about a lot of people, you know, getting a high ping or high lag or ping spikes and disconnects and. Um, I just wanted to bring to light a couple things that people may be experiencing and possibly the root cause of that for some people. Uh, a lot of people are quick to blame the servers and uh, don't know really how to go about fixing it. And um, that's what we're going to talk about today. Okay, So this is relevant to both EU and NA. Uh, I think I hear more about ping and lag related issues coming from EU rather than NA. It seems to be a common uh, common topic for a lot of people from EU actually. And I don't play on EU so I can't say for sure whether or not there are issues with the servers or not. All I can do is give you guys some information. Uh, and the tools to figure out whether or not it actually is the servers or if it's your connection that's suffering. If it's the latter, then it's possible for you to be able to do something about it to make your connection a lot more stable so you can play the game and actually enjoy it. Uh, here we've got a program. It's called Ping Plotter. Okay. Uh, what this program does is it allows you to see how your connection is getting routed to the server whichever server you ping and uh, to see where your connection may be suffering or in fact if it is an NCSoft issue and uh, a problem with their server of course this is going to look different for everyone since everyone looks uh, everyone lives in a different area is connecting you know with different ISPs and getting routed differently uh, to the servers from their home. This is my ping plot, okay? Uh, I live in New York, New York City to be exact, and I'm connecting to Texas, okay? So here you're gonna see my connection, okay, from the beginning. Uh, traveling out of New York, here's my travel time, okay, down to Texas. All right, you can see that there's a massive jump from 4 to 6 to 45, and here it's even jumping up to 90. Uh, this is before, this is the NCSoft server here, okay? So this right here, the, the jump here from 7 to 44, this is mostly travel time from New York to Texas around here, okay? Because remember, our connection does have to travel. This is not really a red flag for me, as this is still in within acceptable ping. Uh, I average around 40 to 50 ping connecting to Dallas, Texas without any you know, ping servers or anything like that. I do have Verizon Fios, which is a fiber connection, uh, and I do not have any lag or ping related issues on NA. Sometimes the game crashes and you know, maybe I've had a disconnect a handful of times in the last couple months but I, I, I think that's pretty common with most games I don't think any server is perfect right um, and here I'm gonna pull up a notepad for you guys and I'm gonna type down the server IPs that you guys need to ping for NA and EU now this was given out by Blade & Soul support okay uh, so I think they are the most uh, reliable servers to ping. Alright, let's see if I can make this a little bigger. Well, there's the EU one, and then for NA, here we go, copy, paste, NA here, okay? Now, uh, you probably can find the IPs for the specific server you are playing on, you know, for NA you can find the Mushin server, Master Hong server, etc, etc. Um, but th these are the IPs that Blaine Soul Support gave out for doing a trace route to NA and EU. 
Now, what you're looking for when you type in the IP up here, okay, I have it. I have to shift it over to the left so I don't show any of my own sensitive uh, information, okay. Uh, and what you're looking for here, like on on my screen, it's showing here. Uh, it's not getting information from this node from the single hop. Uh, I'm not too worried about it as my connection, you know, is still fine going through that. Obviously, I'm not getting a hundred percent packet loss from these. It's just, you know, not giving me information back from that node. Uh, I don't know exactly what that means. It's probably, you know, uh, I I really don't know. But my connection isn't suffering, so I'm not too worried about it. Now, things that you want to look for are massive spikes, okay, uh, here at any node before getting to the NCSoft node, okay? You'll see it here, you'll see your latency go up, and you'll see percents of packet loss here okay on the side if it does say asterisk 100 you're probably just not getting information from the node so don't worry about that um, and if you do see these massive spikes beforehand or massive packet loss beforehand uh, your connection is suffering at you know some kind of node on the way to the server and if that's the case uh, programs like WTFast Ping Zapper, Mudfish, those seem to be the most common three. Uh, all of them have free trials that you can try. And uh, they will usually reroute you differently in a way that you'll be able to avoid that bad node. Uh, if you're still suffering from lag and ping uh, with that node or with one of those uh, ping tools, uh, check check the ping plotter and if you're having issues you know with the NCSoft server you'll see the same thing you'll see packet loss and you'll see spikes by the NCSoft node then you'll know it's your actual server then you know you've got something to complain about because it's completely out of your hands but usually if your ISP is uh, providing you with a really good service and a really good routing service and you know it has a good network you're not going to get those issues uh, traveling to the server that you're playing on. See, I'm not getting, I'm not getting any spikes or ping problems on the actual NCSoft server. Um, another thing that you want to look out for is a node called Level Three. Okay, this node has been causing a lot of problems for people uh, in NA, especially. Uh, Final Fantasy 14 threads are riddled with, you know, ways to avoid level 3. A lot of ISPs have problems with level 3. There are feuds going on with level 3. Consider them like the ISP for your ISPs. They kind of lay down the structure for your ISPs. And uh, if you're hitting that, then that could be the root cause of your problem. And again, the best thing you can do is try to use one of these uh, ping boosters to reroute you. I'll put all relevant information below the video and I'll put links to the various uh, ping boosters and routing services that I know of and I'll also put these uh, IPs for EU and NA down in the description below. Hopefully this uh, sheds some light on some common issues that people might have connecting to the game. And uh, hopefully these things help you in figuring out what your issue may be. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Thank you.